Hey guys, it's me, Jamie, from SophistaMom.com, and I thought it would be fun to start doing a little video blog series. So every week, maybe, I think, we'll, we'll talk about something. Right now, my first goal is to talk about the, the fitness that I'm trying to do. I'm trying to lose. I weighed in today, all right, at 126.8. And I know for some of you that sounds like, man, if only I could weigh 126.8, that would I would be so happy. And I know others of you are really skinny, or you're really tall and you weigh 126, and and you look fabulous. But I'm five foot three, and I really could use to lose, stand to lose about 15, 16 pounds. This morning I did a Tabata workout, which um, there's this Japanese scientist. His last name is Tabata. I can't remember what his first name is, and I certainly don't know how to pronounce his first name, but he came up with this system where basically you you work out for 20 seconds as hard as you possibly can, and then you rest for 10, and then you alternate back and forth doing that until you reach four minutes. So that's like, I mean, who doesn't have four minutes, right? I definitely have four minutes. And I, in the past, in the last year, I've been doing all kinds of things, running, uh, running, jogging, doing crazy diets, like I did the ideal protein diet. I, I've done lots of things in the last year to try to get down to where I am now, but it's like this last bit is not going away. And so I'm trying different things. Um, I read the Gabriel Method, and I think of all the people that are into fitness and health, he really seems to know what he's talking about, and I really respect him because he figured out a way to get himself from 400 pounds to 220 pounds, and he's ripped. He's been talking about Tabata training, so that's what I'm doing, and we'll see if it works. I'll give it some time, and you know, if, if I find after a month that I'm not the weight that I want to be, then maybe I'll add something else or try something a different way. But really the main thing is I want to listen to my body, and I want to invite you to be along for the journey. It's just time that I think we need to get to know one another. I mean, you can read my blog entries, but if I, I usually don't have a lot of time to write a really involved essay about myself, and of course I want to make it sound beautiful, so then that takes more time, and a lot of you probably just don't have a lot of time to read everybody's blogs. So I'm going to be getting to know you, and I hope that you'll be able to get to me, know me a little bit better as well. I want to talk about these, these pro bars. Okay, obviously I'm using my little webcam to do this, so you're going to have to use your imagination. And this is backwards, obviously, but it's by pro bar. Those are those great bars that you find in the health food store. They have these this gorgeous packaging, and they have energy bars and all different kinds of things, but they're fantastic. They sent me some of these Pro Bars to try out. The Core, I'm sorry, the Core Bars. Because Pro Bars, their other, it's like their main label. So the Core is their protein bars. There's 20 grams of protein. It's all vegan, which I love because I read the China study and casein is the protein found in cow's milk. And you just, after reading that book, I really just don't want to go there. So especially if I'm trying to protein load after a workout. So I don't want to be eating large amounts of cow's milk protein. Um, and these don't have it. These, This is soy protein, so some people obviously are going to be sensitive to soy. And of course, you wouldn't be able to have these, but they're, they're fantastic. They taste, let me back up. I mean, the taste is amazing. They, when they first sent me one, I tried the cookie dough flavor, and I swear I took one bite, and I was like, I will do a workout just so I can eat this because it's like a candy bar. This one is the brownie crisp flavor. It's great. My daughter is the same way. She's like, oh, I'll work out for the mint chocolate flavor. Those taste like thin mints. How great. And then finally, they have a peanut butter flavor. So I would highly recommend these. They're, del they're so good. They taste like a candy bar, so I'll taste one. Okay, one more thing after I finished swallowing my bite of protein bar. Please ask questions. Write them in the comment section and if you are curious about anything, anything that I'm doing with my workouts, anything that I'm doing with what I'm eating, 
please let me know and I'll try to answer them. So next week we will have another video blog similar to this one and I'll answer the, your questions and maybe we can talk a little bit more about the Tabata training. Maybe I can show you a workout or two. So good luck, have a great week, and I will see you soon.